Hello everyone, I'm Yi Ting, and today I'm excited to introduce you to the AR World Explorer app. This app provides a user with the opportunity to explore the world's iconic landmark through the captivating AR experiences. If users are interested in a particular landmark, they can simply scan the corresponding card. The app swiftly detects the card, immersing the user in an AR experience to dive deeper into the landmark. The apps offer a detailed explanations and introductions to the landmark, accompanied by visual images. Additionally, it provides information about the construction process and the history of the landmark. The apps also feature a panoramic 360 view options, allowing users to experience the landmark environment. With AR scan feature, user can place the landmark on the ground plans to get a closer look at the 3D view, enabling interactive explorations. Let's dive into exploring the apps. When a user enters the apps, they will be greeted by the home page featuring a list of preview of the various landmarks. User can easily scroll through this list to find the landmark that they are interested in. Or, user can choose for a different approach by clicking the AR scan button located in the bottom navigation bar. Upon clicking the AR scan button, user can use their device camera to scan the card of the specific landmark they want to learn more about. For instance, let's say the user scan the card of the Eiffel Tower. Instantly, a small 3D view of the Eiffel Tower will appear, accompanied by a preview of information about the iconic landmark. User can then click the Read More button to dive deeper into the details and learn more about the Eiffel Tower. Adding to the excitement, user can enjoy another captivating experience by scanning the back of the landmark card, featuring a stunning photograph. When users scan this site, a immersive video unfolds, showcasing the landmark from various angles with captivating cinematic shot. Now, let's explore the info page of the Eiffel Tower. We will go through each feature step by step. For enhanced accessibility, user can find an audio button in the top right corner by clicking it to activate an audio voice that provides an explanation of the Eiffel Tower. While listening, user can also view a few images of the Eiffel Tower on the carousel by clicking the next button. If user wish to stop the audio, a simple press of the audio button will stop the playback. In the heart of Paris, France, stands an iconic symbol of elegance and innovation, the Eiffel Tower. Built for the 1889 World's Fair, this iron masterpiece was Moving on, there's the AR ground scan feature. User can click the button in the top right corner by scanning the ground, a 3D model of the Eiffel Tower in real life in front of a user screen. User can pinch and scale to interact with it. To return to the info page, user can click the back button. Next, explore a 360 view around the Eiffel Tower environment by clicking the button next to the audio button and users have the chance to immerse themselves beneath the Eiffel Tower, moving around to experience the environment. To return to the info page, click the back button. For a deeper dive into details about the Eiffel Tower, user can scroll vertically on the info page to explore the constructions and history of the landmark. They can click the button for comprehensive explanations along with visual images. Once users finish reading through the info, they can click the home button on the bottom navigation bar to return to the home page. Alternatively, if users want to continue scanning the cards to explore another landmark, they can click the AR scan button in the middle of the navigation bar or click the back button. Now I'm going to show you how the user can continue exploring other landmarks.
The Leaning Tower of Pisa is one of Italy's major tourist attractions. The freestanding bell tower of the Pisa Cathedral was built over almost 200 years and was finished in 1399. The original height of the tower was 60 meters, 196 feet, but as it is leaning, the lowest side is now less than 56 meters, 184 feet. The construction already caused many problems as the soil was soft, sandy and unstable. Already during construction, The Statue of Liberty, adorned with a copper skin, is affectionately known as Lady Liberty. Designed by Frederick Auguste Bartholdi, the lady's massive iron skeleton was masterfully crafted by Alexander Gustave Eiffel, renowned for the Eiffel Tower. Completed in France in 1884, the statue underwent a remarkable journey. Disassembled into 350 pieces, it was packed into 214 crates and shipped to New York. A generous gift from the people of France to the American people, it was unveiled on the American Centennial in 1886. An epitome of modern architectural brilliance, the Petronas Twin Towers in Malaysia soar to a height of approximately 451.9 meters. Situated in the Kuala Lumpur city center, KLCC, these iconic twin towers stand as a symbol of Malaysia's economic prowess and technological advancement.
Construction of the towers was completed in 1998, marking them as the tallest twin towers globally. Connected by a sky bridge at the 41st and 42nd floors, the towers boast a sleek and contemporary design, reflecting a blend of Islamic-inspired motifs and cutting-edge technology. The Arc de Triomphe, situated at the prestigious place Charles de Gaulle in Paris, France, is an iconic triumphal arch that stands as a testament to France's rich history. Commissioned by Napoleon Bonaparte after his victory at Austerlitz, construction on this monumental arch began in 1806 and was completed in 1836. Designed by Jean Chalgrin, the Arc de Triomphe serves as a powerful symbol of national pride and unity. Rising approximately 50 meters, the arch features intricate reliefs and sculptures that depict scenes from French military history. The Tomb of the Unknown Soldier lies beneath the arch, honoring those who lost their lives in World War I. Visitors can ascend to the top of the Arc de Triomphe to enjoy breathtaking views of Paris, including the famous Champelot. Here comes to the end of the video walkthrough. Thanks for exploring the AR World Explore apps with me. I hope you enjoy the journey. Bye!